In this video we are going to talk about 10 best places to visit in Bulgaria. So before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. Between its borders, Bulgaria offers everything from sun-kissed beaches to captivating historical histories, vibrant party towns to snow-shrouded ski resorts, rolling down from the pine-clad massifs of the Balkan Mountains and the Rodopi Ranges to meet the brilliant blues of the Black Sea. We look at all of the big attractions that should be on everyone's Bulgarian bucket list this year in this guide to the country's 10 finest locations to visit. Number 10. Varna. Varna is much more than simply a run-of-the-mill resort town on the coast of the Black Sea. It is the sun-drenched favorite of local Bulgarians heading out of Sofia and Plovdiv for the summer. Yes, sir, the city attracts to history fans and cultural vultures alike, with a lengthy and fascinating history, a plethora of decaying Roman bathhouses, and magnificent Orthodox architecture, such as the practically unpronounceable Dormition of the Mother of God Cathedral. Varna is a vital hub for commerce, transportation, education, tourism, entertainment, and healthcare. The Bulgarian Navy and Merchant Marine have their headquarters in the city, which is known as the country's maritime center. The Council of Europe named Varna as the seat of the Black Sea Euroregion in 2008. Varna received the title of European Youth Capital 2017 in 2014. Of course, the beaches are still a significant draw, and one bustling sand side promenade entices visitors with a plethora of seafood eateries and cocktail bars, while after dark, frenetic clubs explode right on the edge of the beach. Number 9. Veliko Tarnovo. On the edge of the rising foothills of Bulgaria's northern mountains, the mythical city of the Tsars looms tall. The town's environment is nothing short of spectacular, with terraces of terracotta colored roofs looming over the waterways below bisected by the Yantra River's S-shaped meanders. The charming cobblestone pathways and half-timbered houses of this town's old town are great examples of the Tarnovo school, which arose when the Second Bulgarian Empire expanded in the Middle Ages. That means visitors will encounter a mix of natural beauty, thanks to the untamed coniferous trees that blanket the regions all around, an unbridled culture and history, pouring from the Tsarevitz Palace and a slew of beautiful Byzantine churches. Number 8. Sofia. Bulgaria's enormous capital is something of a patchwork of its own history. The vast brutalist monuments to Soviet domination rise around it, as do countless streams of cookie-cutter high-rises. The historic remains of the Serdica Fort and the Roman Byzantine Church of St. George sit in the shadow of Stalinist municipal structures closer to the city center. Sofia is a pretty enough city with a vibrant cafe and nightlife scene. It does not attract tourists in the same manner that other Eastern European capital towns, Budapest, Prague, do, and as a result it is not considered one of the region's top tourist destinations. Then there are the Alexander Nevsky Cathedral's famous Orthodox domes and gilded edifices, which gleam beneath the snow-capped peaks of Vitosha Mountain in the distance. It's all quite varied, and it never fails to impress visitors who choose to spend some time here. Number 7. Zorovna. Zorovna is a rustic and raw depiction of one of Bulgaria's most iconic architectural forms of old, and it is a display in all things Bulgarian national revival. The town itself is located at the base of the majestic Balkan Mountains, tucked between dense thickets of Bosnian pines and white elms, where its timber-clad, stony aspect appears almost organically made. The cottages that dot the cobblestone lanes have all been meticulously repaired, with over 150 specimens of the traditional hardwood facades on show. The Jordan Yavkov House and the icon-packed St. Nicholas Church draw the most audiences among the buildings, while others will go to the neighboring August Dobromiritsa Rural Park, where events showcasing Bulgarian folk costumes and music erupt throughout the year. Number 6. Burgas. Burgas is one of the most popular entry points to the Black Sea Coast's southern reaches. It's a primarily modern affair with Art Deco rises and groomed parks on the edge of the sea, a far cry from the ancient and historic centers that dot the country elsewhere. It also hosts some of Bulgaria's most vibrant music festivals, such as the raucous spirit of Burgas, which takes place every summer. Burgas also has another ace up its sleeve, the breathtakingly beautiful trio of lakes that run from the bird-spotting paradise of Vaya to the saline waters of Atanazovsko in the north. Burgas is a big port city on the Black Sea coast in the southeast. Planes that frequently transport tourists to Bulgaria land here. 
Tourist attractions in Burgas, interesting places to visit, monuments, and anything else. The city is an excellent jumping off location for visiting adjacent resorts. Number 5. Rila Monastery. Rila, possibly the world's most famous Eastern Orthodox monastery, has risen to become a veritable icon of the Bulgarian country. It was included to the UNESCO World Heritage List in 1983, and is known for its unique blend of Mamluk, Arabesque, Byzantine, and Romanesque styles, as well as its magnificent iconostasis walls, which are carefully carved and inlaid with gleaming gold leaf. An on site museum aids visitors in unraveling the site's more than 1,000 years of history, while countless courtyards and peristyles adorned with murals and medieval themes provide plenty art and architecture to capture the eye. Number 4. Piran National Park. The Piran National Park, which is UNESCO listed and rises like a giant Balkan bastion against Macedonia and Greece's borders, is a hinterland unlike any other in Europe. Its snow capped summits absorb mist, while alpine valleys below are crisscrossed with avalanches of forest green pine and fir trees, with the occasional bed of edelweiss strewn around. Wild goats ascend atop the rugged precipices to find shelter in the rocky crevices and caverns. While deer and bears pursue the woodlands to this day. With trails ascending to the summit of Viren, the highest peak, and looping around the astonishing 186 mountain lakes, it's no surprise that this one is recognized as a hiker's and outdoorsy type's heaven. Number 3. Belogradchik. The town is a popular tourist attraction. The medieval Belogradchik fortress and the Belogradchik rocks are two local features. The neighboring Magura Cave, noted for its prehistoric cave paintings, and the Baba Vita Medieval fortification in the nearby Danube town of Vidin, are two more tourist attractions in the vicinity. The surreal geological treasures that hide on the outskirts of Belogradchik town rarely fail to astonish visitors who trek to this remote region of Bulgaria on the Balkan Mountains' northern slopes. The Belogradchik rocks, or simply the Belogradchik rocks, are a sweeping display of hoodoos and anthropomorphic monoliths that have inspired numerous folk stories and local folklore. Belogradchik's draws, however, do not end there. No way, sir, not with the huge Belogradchik fortress complex, the fortress of adjacent Baba Vita, and the fascinating prehistoric wall art of the Magura Cave on the itinerary. Number 2. Plovdiv. Plovdiv, which is spread out over seven hills along the Maritza River, is home to a diverse range of historical sites, including Roman amphitheaters, Thracian fortifications, honorific monuments to Bulgaria's own crumb the fearsome, national revival churches, and even the rare Soviet tenement. The Old World Historic Center, however, must be seen to be believed. A Game of Thrones esque palette of stone clad fortresses and serpentine passageways, Byzantine arches, and hidden squares. Oh, and after hours, Plovdiv's nightlife invites partygoers, as coffee culture haunts turn hedonistic, fueling nights with indie, jazz, and a plethora of Balkan beers. Number 1. Perperikon. Perperikon is a must see for any history enthusiasts and culture vultures traveling through Bulgaria, with indications of human settlement reaching back over seven millennia and what has been dubbed the most spectacular monolithic building in the entire Balkan peninsula crowning its hilltops. It's assumed that Copper Age priests utilized the hill for rituals and soothsaying before it was built up and defended by the Thracian tribespeople. Legend has it that the hill foretold the coming of both Alexander the Great and Imperial Rome under Augustus. Visitors can now tour the off the beaten path dig site, while relics and findings are best viewed at Karjali's local archaeology museum. What do you think about our list of the 10 best things to do in Bulgaria? Please let us know your thoughts in the comment box. Thank you.